mobile phone videography to the next level. You know, that's what you're gonna learn in this video. Now, whether you don't need pro camera to record great video, you have it in your pocket, you know, mobile phone. Whatever brand, it doesn't matter. Every one of them will shoot a great video. In this video, you're gonna learn about that. You know, to achieve exactly that, I'm gonna be sharing with you three main hacks. You know, first hack, how you set your phone, either the Samsung or iPhone, to be able to shoot cinematography. And second, if audio is part of your storytelling, so then you need to look into external microphone. And third, what resources or accessory you need in terms of handling your phone better in terms of filming. So those three men hack. So I welcome you into my channel. My name is Kolbasi House, but you can call me just Colby. And before we get into, you know, setting the phone, I have one announcement that I want to make. So you see this microphone. So I'm giving away. I'm giving away this microphone. So stay tuned. At the end of this video, I'm going to explain how you going to get this microphone. What do you need to do to get this microphone? So stay tuned. Hack number one, how to set your phone to shoot cinematography. So for Samsung user and also iPhone user, look at the description below so you see exactly in what time frame, you know, the video setting for iPhone or Samsung is. So you can scroll exactly to that precise time, not to waste your time. So as I'm using iPhone, yeah? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go to my setting. In setting, you scroll down till you find, you know, camera. Camera. And you go into the camera, and in the camera setting, you know, you have few options. So I select, I mean, firstly, I wanna put my grid on. I'm gonna have a video explaining what grid is, what is the rule of third, so stay tuned. So now after setting up my grid, so I'm gonna go into you know, record video. So in the recording video, so you got few options, right? You have this 720p, that's like, a, that's standard HD, and you have the full HD 1080, and you have two type of 1080, one at 30 frames per second, one at 60 frames per second. And then you got the 4K, it's like four times the full HD at 24 frames per second and also 30 frames per second and also 60 frames per second. For here, I always choose 4K 60 frames per second. So that's that's the part of the video, the recording video is set. And then we go back and then you got the second options. If you want to record slow motion, right? And sometimes it's nice to have slow motion, not overdo it, but slow motion. And here you have three options, 1080, is like a full HD at 120 frames per second, or you have 720 at 240 frames per second, or you have 1080 at 240 frames per second. It's very, very slow. But I think usually, but no, no, usually I choose just 1080 at 120 frames per second. And you know, if you want to make it slower, so you know where to, where to find them, so you just go there. So that is, you know, our camera, the iPhone camera is set, you know, ready uh, to shoot videos. Are you liking this video so far? And if so, like it, please. And also, if you have not subscribed yet to my channel, I don't know, what's your waiting to subscribe my channel? Subscribe now and also press the notification bell next to it. And if you're a returning subscriber, you, you forgot to press the notification bell next to it. So press it now too. So then, you know, every time that I have a new video, you're going to be notified straight away that there is a video right there. Okay, let's carry on. Okay, you know, um, with Samsung, a little bit different than, you know, the iPhone that I show. So firstly, we need to open the camera. So that's the camera. So in the camera, you got in, you know, the right hand side of the phone, you got the setting button. So you press on the setting. And in that setting, you know, camera setting, you got a list of stuff. You got picture, you got video. But today, because we are focusing only on the video setting, so I'm just gonna focus on the video setting. So I go to the video setting. So now we're going to set, you know, the size um, 
of the camera. The rear size and the front size. So let me start with the rear side. Rear side is mean, you know, the camera here at the back here. I don't know what is that. Is it somewhere here? Yeah, that's the camera here. So let's open the rear side camera. So you have few innovation. You have a full, you have one-to-one, -one, and you have resolution. What we're gonna focus on, we're gonna focus on the resolution. You know, like the, the 16 by nine resolution. That's what I'm gonna select. And in that 16 by nine resolution, you have options. So let me open the option that we have. So you have a full, no, ultra HD. So you have ultra HD, and also you have whatever the QHD, you have full HD, and even full HD, you have two options, one 60 frames per second, and one is just 30 frames per second, and you have a 12 by 80 by, you know, 720, it's like a 720, it's just, it's just a normal HD. So for you to get a nice image, you set the thing on the Ultra HD. The resolution, when you reduce it to the full HD, you still get a great quality image. So that's why you set it that to the Ultra HD. Otherwise, it's called 4K. So that's for the rear you know, video camera. And then for the front, same thing. So we go there, we, we got the 16 by nine. Here again, you know, you select, not not a quite like a 4K, is that a 2K. So we can put that on 2K. You, you know the good thing about Samsung, yeah? Samsung, even the front, camera is much better than, you know, the, the iPhone one. Because the iPhone, you even don't have uh, 2K. So, you know, the front camera also set. So what next? So our camera set is ready. So let's go shoot some video. All right, guys, you know, first, you know, first and foremost thing here, yeah. The one, one thing that is most important, when we pull up, you know, the phone from our pocket to film, we usually start just like, you know, the way that we, we use the phone to speak. So, you know, that's the way that we, we pull up the phone and then we think that we need to shoot that way. It depends. So if you want your video for, I don't know, Instagram, Snapchat, or all, you know, those kind of, you know, social media thing, but some social media so that you know you can you can just shoot it like this so but if you know you want your video for youtube facebook or even you know showing on your tv on your computer so then you know that's how how you you hold your camera so i'm going to hold it this way and when you hold it this way so that you know the sensor use the whole you're using the whole sensor but that way is how i'm doing so now I'm filming 60, I'm filming, uh, sorry, I'm, I'm filming 4K, 60 frames per second. That's how, how, how you film, right? Straight away from your camera, you film like, you know, whatever frame rate that you, you, you want. Hack number two. You know, the quality of a video depend on the sound quality that you capture. The sound just captured straight away on the phone. It's not that great. So what do you need to do? I, 
you know, bought myself a microphone. A very cheap, it's 39 pounds on Amazon. It's a road uh, video mic. And with this one, you can capture quality sound. So from now, you know, whatever I shoot, the sound will be coming from the microphone. So let's get some shoot and some, you know, voice on and then we can compare. Right now, I am filming with the iPhone microphone. No external microphone needed just to check how the sound is gonna be. The sound may be good because the, the camera is close to me, but we will see the difference between those two. So now I am using the Rode microphone plug into the iPhone just to see the difference in, in the sound quality if there is any improvement compared to the microphone of the iPhone, you know, as such. That's a test. In terms of microphone, yeah? But if you cannot afford that, so those headsets, you can also use them. Why you use them? Because if you put that in your ears, you know, the microphone is much closer to, you, to your mouth compared to if you're holding, if you're holding the, the camera, you know, such, so that's far away. So the, when the microphone is more closer to your mouth, you get a better sound quality, you know, as such. So you can use just, if you don't have an external microphone, you can use your headphone as such as a set of microphone. So now what I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add some accessory. So let's get some accessory. Hack number three is essential, you know, accessory. All right, so you see, for example, you know, the lens that you have here on your camera, right? That's as good as it can get. But you know, you cannot stop there. It's like any camera. So for your mobile phone, you can also add some lens. So they're cheap, but they give you great quality. So I bought those, those three lenses here, the different three lenses, just for 25 pounds on Amazon. So we're gonna fit, fit them on it and then do some video and then we'll see the difference. So now I'm gonna fit, you know, this lens to the camera called macro. Macro is mean that you can even get very, very close to the, to the, to the subject that you want to film. And you get that, um, that's a mini, mini detail. So I'm getting really close. You see, otherwise, you know, without, without, without this macro lens, we cannot get you know, the picture of, or the video of, you know, the flower as close, as detailed as such. So that's why, you know, those kind of lens will take, you know, your video in to the absolutely next level. Great. So in top of the lenses, you also need to look into this accessory as well. Just look at, you know, the, um, you know, the phone. You know, sometimes it's quite difficult just to hold it like that because you need you need your you need your footage to be as steady as possible because no one has 100 percent steady hand so we all have a shaky hand but you know to help you know your camera because you know your phone is 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 a talking tool it's not a camera as such so ergonomically is not set very well just to hold it when you do it filming so then you know my advice is looking into those, you know, cheap accessories that will help you improve the ergonomic of your phone, you know, such when you come down to filming. So I have a few things that I'm going to show you. So first accessory that I want to show you is this hand, is this grip, All right? This grip. It's so good, it's so comfortable. So I put it there, great. So I have something and it's, you know, you can hold the two hand, you can hold the one hand. So it make it a little bit heavier. So then, you know, it's easy kind of to hold it steady, you know, as such. And the great thing about this one is that you have the shoe man here. What is that important? Because if you have external microphone, you know, as such at this thing. So what you can do, you can put it on the top, right? Put it on the top plug it here 
and done you know i have this one so you see that is how as good as that everything is all accessory that I want to show you is lighting is light because you know the phone as such the sense of the phone there are no good when there's no light when it's in the dark so to improve you know the quality when there's no light so you need to have those kind of small light so you have so this one you know small and I think it's, it's also cheap so you can get the small one so the, you know the good thing about you know the small one you can also just in you know, for example this one yeah, i can just put it here and put it like this and then have it like this and then you know i, I talk so yeah you can have also external battery i think yeah. nowadays almost everybody got external battery but if you don't have one so you need to get external battery when it comes down to shooting because you know the battery of your phone is just gonna the camera filming just gonna suck the battery like no one business so have an external battery so that you can connect it as well with your phone to charge it you know, whenever you need to charge it as such. So that's, so yeah, that's in terms of the accessory. As I promised in the beginning, I am giving away this microphone. There's three things that you need to do, simple thing. You know, first one, you need to be a subscriber. If you have not subscribed yet to my channel, please do hit the subscribe button right now and also press the notification bell next to it. You know, the second thing that we need to do is to reach 100 likes for this video. So like this video. Third thing to do is just put in a comment box below, just like a short, you know, one or two sentence, you know, telling us what video you're planning to shoot with this microphone. And if you do those three things, if you accomplish those three things, you know, we need to get 100 likes for this video. You'll be subscriber. And also just write a sentence or two about what video you need to shoot with this microphone. And this microphone will be yours. I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna send it wherever you are. You're gonna get it, promise. So yeah, that's a simple thing. And I hope you find this video very useful. You know, so far in my YouTube tutorial, there is three videos that I made. One is to create your YouTube channel. And if you have not created a YouTube channel yet, there is a link here for this video. And second video is how you can make YouTube videos the right way. And if you have not watched this video, there is a link there, you can watch it too. And this last video is about shooting a YouTube video, great video by using your phone. How do you set your phone? How accessory you need audio and all those kind of things. So that's good. The next video in that series of YouTube tutorial will be how to edit those footage that you shoot together. Edit that in the computer or is in your phone. So I'm gonna have a video on that. So stay tuned. Subscribe, like this video, and share as wide as possible. And I'm looking forward, you know, to see you again, you know, next time. Now, I'm, I'm not gonna literally see you, you're gonna see me, but I'm gonna be happy to be around you.